everybody, it's Mia. So today I'm going to be doing a charm update for you all and um, all of these pieces will be listed on my Etsy shop and they should be already listed by the time this video is uploaded. So a link to my shop will be in the description box below so be sure to check that out if you're interested. And let's go ahead and get started. So the first couple pieces I have for you are these hand-painted uh, panda charms and I still need to glaze these and add a tail to this one and a little pink bow or red bow. So this is the boy and the girl. I'm debating whether or not to put paws on this one because um, I think this one would have looked a little bit better had I not added the outline of the paw, but I still think it's pretty cute. So there's those two. Then I made these, I don't remember the name of these bunnies, but um, I saw some uh, memo pads, uh, sheets that had these characters on it and just these little round bunnies with pockets on them. So I made three different ones. This one's blue with yellow hearts. This one's supposed to be pink uh, with some white stripes. And there's this green one, crisscross pattern or plaid pattern. So I got those. Then I made some dumpling charms, and these ones are fairly simple, but I think they're absolutely adorable. So I textured the top, as you can see, and just added a cute little face on it, and I have five of them. Oh, I think they're just really, really cute. They will come in self and straps, of course. Then I have, excuse the plane, <laughs> um, these little marshmallow characters. I don't remember what the brand is called, like as far as the memo pad goes or just the series or whatever. But these are just little marshmallow characters. And yeah, so I have six of them. This one's a white cat. And I didn't get a good look at the blue one, but I just assumed it would be a bear. So I just kind of made a bear. This one is a yellow bear. This one I believe is supposed to be a bunny of some sort or a, a pink dog, I'm not too entirely sure. Here's a panda, it's one of my favorites. And last marshmallow is my absolute favorite of the batch. It's this, um, I don't know why I pronounced it like that, this. <laughs> A cat and I absolutely love the brown patches on this because um, it's a little sparkly I mix some gold clay into this so it's really really nice and that's that then I made this carved pumpkin uh, Duffy charm and I believe we're still in fall but yeah so I textured the pumpkin um, and yeah, I think he's absolutely adorable. And last but not least, I have these glow-in-the-dark Oogie Boogie um, necklace pendants. And I hand-painted the Oogie Boogie onto the heart. So, uh, and I just made four. I had one listed up on my Etsy and it sold really quickly. So I went ahead and made four more, just in case. But, uh, yeah. And, um... It does glow in the dark, so I'll either provide a picture here or you can um, visit my Etsy shop and see the picture where it's glowing. And I think it's absolutely gorgeous. So just even a little bit of sunlight makes this thing glow really nicely. So that's that. And that completes the update, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, again, don't forget to check out the description box below because I have my shop link there in case you're interested in purchasing. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and leave some feedback down below and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!